What's up? I'm Tyler. I'm AJ. We're in the band issues. One of my favorite tour memories, per se, is once upon a time, I was on tour with Sleeping With Sirens. After Hours was a like a club night, and it just so happened to be like the, the third Thursday of the month or something, which was fetish night. So all these Marilyn Manson looking ass people came out, and like it was really weird, but we we're all just like, okay, I guess we'll stick around and see what's up. Anyways, long story short, there's like a whipping station where you could get tied up or like pinned up and you could like get whipped. And me and Kellen Quinn ended up strapped up and, and whipped. It was pretty funny because Kellen was, I think it was getting pretty painful for Kellen, but someone told me if you get into it, it doesn't hurt as bad. So I uh, proceeded to try my best to be into it and, and, and be verbal about it, but it still hurt just as bad. <laughs> That's my story, so what's your story? We were on tour with Silverstein. We had a little tour manager. Every time he drove the van, he, he whipped. He would like, he would drive, even on icy roads, Very he'd be going out. like 80 miles an hour on the iciest streets ever. I love that dude. <laughs> He's just crazy. We were we were exiting in, well, I don't in. even know what state it was. It was Ohio, Ohio we're getting off the freeway. <clears throat> doesn't slow down to get we were off the off ramp. Already scared. We we're already as hell scared cuz we we've already been sliding yeah, all night. All like of our friends had like black we heard ice. stories about black guys. He does not slow down. So, I'm in my bunk sleeping and I wake up to him going, excuse my language. Fuck, 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 fuck. I woke up to that. <laughs> so I just I woke up, I literally oh, pushed my so hands scary. against my bunk to brace myself cuz I Legitimately thought I was gonna die. Oh, I remember. And then we it. slide off the off the road into the, the snow, and man almost tips. And no, we we, we jackknifed jack entirely with the trailer. And okay, anyway, fast forward past all that, we we skid off the road. So I decided to walk outside and go up the hill that we slid down and take a picture. So I go up there and take my little picture. Walk back down towards the van. Shortly after I got in the uh. van, another car slides off of the hill right where I was standing and comes straight towards our van. And then our tour manager in the front seat, he goes, ah! and then, like, the car comes and just hits the trailer and unjackknifes it. Can I just say that I was, I was, I like, sitting in the that. front seat, and I saw AJ, and my life, like, my, my stomach dropped. I thought this fool was about to just get taken out. But, yeah, like, another person hit the same patch of black eyes, came flying off the road. Where I was standing. Like, right literally was caught standing. air and almost wiped out AJ, like, just by a couple feet. And like you said, it rammed our trailer and unjackknifed our thing. So they were pretty much fucked, but we actually, it actually helped us because it unjackknifed our trailer. So we were actually able to drive right out of there. But so there's our crazy tour stories. They're not as crazy as some may, may say, but those are the, the crazy ones that we can live to talk about.